Thanks everybody for coming. We're here to watch Cam here on the Velocity Channel and check this out. This has been several years in the uh, works of him building this car. It's really cool to see all these people here. <laughs> it's going very well and very busy, but good. I'm not famous, no, but I did build the door handles. Tonight's pretty good. It's kind of exciting. It'll be cool to relive Vegas. All the hard work that's been put into this car. There is no fiberglass in this car whatsoever. Every bit of this car is out of steel or aluminum, crafted by hand. This is SEMA, Battle of the Builders. SEMA show has been incredible. I've been doing it for over 15 years. And there is no better place to get noticed than right here at SEMA. It's become really popular on the Velocity Channel and mainstream TV as far as what people want to see in innovation. After a long night of deliberation, we finally got our official top 21. Next up, Cam Miller for his 1969 Chevy Camaro. I've worked with them for over 10 years and see it come to this been, it's been neat. It's been a huge day here at SEMA and as the show winds down for the evening, our judges are still at it. Coming up, we announce the top 10 contenders. It's unreal. I, I never thought I'd be a part of something so big. We genuinely put a lot of thought and consideration to this and it's gotten more and more difficult here in the third it's year. It's interesting knowing that such a quality builder is uh, doing my cars also. Cam Miller has each of these rides are amazing examples of automotive craftsmanship, setting the standard for the rest of the world. But there can only be one winner, and at this point, the judges are out of the picture. Now it's in the hands of the builders themselves. Pretty intense to watch it, even now. We'll start at the front. It's a twin turbo LSX 427, uh, all GM performance parts. The motor's been pushed back four inches just to get a little better balance and get more room for the turbos. We scratch made the all the hot and cold side, 1,230 horse to the crank. When you're in the car, I want you to know you, you're in this car. So the theme goes all the way through this car. We cut the whole tail of the car off, center fuel. Otherwise, that's it, guys. I appreciate it. It's an honor. I'm glad to be talking cars with you guys. I'm competing so. with my heroes. I'm competing against the best of the best. Right, the third finalist for this year's SEMA Battle of Builders is Cam Miller and his 1969 Chevy Camaro. Well, I'm thinking about all of the junk cars I had in my garage for years. And I want the world to know the amount of work that actually goes into a build like this. They're into detail. They know detail, and that's what makes them special. In first place, for the SEMA, Battle of the Builders is... Cam Miller and his 1969 Chevy Camaro. It's way out there. The win there was phenomenal. It was a powerful experience. Unbelievable, just the, we're winning against the people that we admire. Wow, I mean, this is so special to me. Look at this. I think about everybody cried at some point. Me and my crew, just some hard working dudes up in Logan, Utah. And here we are, holy crap. My employees worked so hard on this car, especially the last six months, nonstop, nonstop. It's more than just a car. This car has so many hearts and souls involved in it. Well, you're such a great representative of the hobby, man. Another hand for Cam. So there you have Where it. A legitimate car builder got put on the map as the number one builder. Watching it and being able to view it from another perspective, it still gives me chills. It's, it's exciting to watch that and share that with a lot of people that are very important to me in my life.